found out what Taylor Swift thinks of your mustache? Um, yeah, we're not going to bring up Taylor Swift. Uh... <laughs> I'm having more fun during this time of my life than I've ever had before. I've legitimately never been happier. You all, things are beginning to get excessively comfortable in the Taylor and Travis universe. At first, we heard bits of hearsay that the two may be considering taking things to a higher level and that they are really significant about this entire thing. However, presently, it's not simply bits of gossip. Travis's own sibling, Jason, has approached to spill the deets on everything that has been happening between these two. What's more, you better support yourself for this one since this person knows a great deal. Since Taylor and Travis have given him the okay to converse with the press, the person has been rambling about how fixated Travis has gotten with Taylor. Furthermore, it's not new that Jason has begun discussing Travis and his fixation on the artist. No, sir, he's been discussing these two for quite a while. In August, not long before the NFL season started off, Kelsey he had a great time visit with his sibling on their webcast. Jason, the Philadelphia Falcons player, unexpectedly raised the subject of a specific vocalist. At the point when Jason saw Kelsey's mustache return, he was unable to oppose getting some information about Taylor Quick's considerations on the new beard growth. Only a couple of days after Kelsey let the cat out of the bag about expanding the Pointed Stone welcome, think about who moved into his September 24th game at Pointed Stone Arena. That's right, Taylor. Cameras were all around her during the game as she chilled in Kelsey's suite close by his mother Donna. To finish it off, they made an upscale exit together in his convertible. Kelsey discussed the awe-inspiring night on his webcast with Jason, saying in an episode dropped on September 27th. Shout out to Taylor for uh, for pulling up. That was pretty ballsy. I just thought it was awesome how everybody in the suite had nothing but great things to say about her. You know, the, the friends and family, she looked amazing. Everybody was talking about her. In, uh, in... <laughs> to see the slow motion chest bumps, to see the, the, the high fives with mom, to uh, to see how you know Chiefs Kingdom was all excited that she was there. That was absolutely hysterical, and it was uh, it was definitely a game I'll remember. That's for damn. Furthermore, as they made their exit after the game, he spilled the deets. Then we just slid off in the getaway car at the end. Took my Chevelle to the game, and shout out to Taylor for coming through and see me rock the stick. Giving a sign of approval for one of Quick's tunes, "Fast Vehicle," and afterward, Jason felt that they expected to examine the woman more. Thus, we began to bring her up additional frequently in their fixations. Also, you know what? All he needed to do was pose one minuscule inquiry. Also, Travis would continue forever about her. On one more episode of New Levels, with Jason and Travis Kelsey dropping on October 18th, Kelsey let the cat out of the bag about his end-of-the-week adventures in NYC. Furthermore, we should simply say it was an out-of-control thrill ride of fervor, including a visit to Saturday Night Live. It was electric to be back in that place. Dude, it's, There's it's just crazy something how much about in there. being in that, that room and just it being their first episode this season. I had such a freaking blast. Kelsey spouted about his SNL appearance, having recently facilitated the show recently. Kelsey gave a major holler to maker Lorne Michaels for the warm greeting to the show. He really wanted to offer his thanks for the help they got, referencing. Uh, her and Taylor nice. are good friends. We showed up at SNL having, having the, uh, the idea of going supporting Ice Spice. Presently, we should discuss the web buzz encompassing the previews and clasps, catching the couple's different excursions where Kelsey was the ideal noble man, helping quick all through the vehicle and holding her hand. Like whenever I'm on a date, I'm all, I'm always like having like the sense of like I'm a man in the situation. I I am I'm like protective. Yeah, for sure. You always kind of have that feeling or that uh self-awareness, I guess. The Kelsey siblings likewise dished on the extraordinary second when Quick took part in a visit with their father, Ed Kelsey, at the Bosses game on October 12th at Sharpened Stone Arena. Kelsey in the spotlight. <laughs> if you were watching the game, you saw something uh, momentous happen, which was Taylor Swift talking to uh, Ed Kelsey. You know dad. Like, I know dad. This is a terrifying <laughs> conversation. I felt terrible for uh, Taylor for being in there. If you see dad talking to anybody and you can't hear what's happening, who knows where that conversation's going. We can't. We can't. Jason added the two siblings sharing a giggle as they concurred that with regards to their mother, Donna, there is no requirement for concern. Kelsey guaranteed, particularly taking note of his mother's past sightings with Quick during games. In a late October episode of New Levels with Jason and Travis Kelsey, the Birds community let the cat out of the bag to his sibling about how his game appears to hit one more level, when Quick is there giving a shout out to him. The siblings additionally addressed the startling help from Kelsey's mentor, Andy Reid. 
for the maturing sentiment. Quick forward a couple of days, and an inquisitive journalist at a Kansas City boss's public interview examined Kelsey about being enamored happily. He kept it bashful. Kelsey's outing to Argentina to get Quick's exhibition toward the beginning of November was absolutely significant. So what is your take? Remark down beneath and let us know. In the event that you like this video, click the buy-in button and hit the chime symbol to be quick to see my next video.